Welcome to Comic Toy Reviews. And this is a review on the Marvel Legends Blackheart action figure. This character is best known for his appearances in the Marvel and Capcom video games. Uh, he's been in the comic books, but not too popular. Even uh, as a comic fan, he really isn't too known, but the video games really helped make this character get known. And years later, this is one of those characters you actually appreciate more. Maybe you didn't think it was such a good figure then, but looking back on it, it's a good figure. One great thing here is the size. Look at this. Next to Wolverine, he's considerably taller. Or even next to, say, a, a Spider-Man figure. You can see Blackheart is quite tall. Just want to show you the details first. Look, he got red eyes. No nose or mouth, but all of these are... Look at that unique sculpt on the hair, whatever it is. It's all unique, this sculpt in detail. Just check that out. He has skin that... Hopefully it's going to show up. It looks like boils. That's the best way to describe it. Is it like some boils or texture? I mean, all over you could see all this. It's on the tail. Even though his costume, for lack of a better word, is just one solid color and red eyes, he is probably one of the taller Marvel Legends at this scale without being a builder figure. And it is accurate because if you look at the video game, he really is a tall character. It's a unique sculpt. It's a really good figure. And look at this. It has, so you could, looks like a hoof so he could stand on his toes. Or you can make the feet flat so it stands like that. It's a pretty unique feet design. You could have the toes look to stand on. Or you can make the feet straight. Just want to try to show you the details on this head. Really nicely done. And the skin here. All of these little details you gotta appreciate. The only little negative is the tail here. It really doesn't bend. It's very stiff. It's uh, tough plastic. You're not really gonna get much posability out of this tail. So it's mostly just going to stay in a very plain position or two. But the rest of it is highly articulated. Look at the head up and down. Good range of motion on the sides. The shoulders side to side, up and down. And it has the upper articulation. Double elbow. Uh, right at the wrist you can spin it there. In or out the hand. And the three fingers because it's a four-fingered creature uh, on an articulation point. Upper body and side to side. Hips side to side. Up and down. Upper articulation here. Has double knees. Articulation there. And the feet, very unique. Up and down, side to side. And the three toes are articulated. So Blackheart overall, uh, I would recommend it for fans of the video game. More affordable characters on the market still. And uh, years later I actually like this character better than when I originally bought him. Thanks for watching and talk to you later. You've heard it in the video game, Blackheart Rises and Armageddon.